is today the day where we finally get the redemption arc for Feral the Barkhorn? Let's find out in the next episode of Raid Shadow Legends. What's up guys, MTG Jedi here. How you doing today? Big shout out to my dude Robot helping me with the sweet title for the video today. Either way, we got so many things going on in the game. Basically, you just have to decide what you want to do. But for me, I would love to have Feral the Barkhorn. Is he my most wanted champion? At least he's up there. He's one of the most wanted champions on my account. Um, I love everything about him. He's got the perfect veils. He's got the block buffs. Um, he's got the A1 decrease speed. All of that is great. But it's really the passive that makes him so amazing. Increases the team's damage by 20%. Well, really, each ally, if they have four or more buffs. And if you know me, I love lots of buffs in my Hydra teams. Either way, I think there's a lot of great options on this progressive chance event, if you would like to pull. Um, I think a lot of people will be pulling for Harima. I personally love Ragash. I wouldn't mind more copies of him. I, I just, I don't know. I have lots of him built. I, I wouldn't mind building a full team of Ragashes. Anyway, that's a story for another day. Uh, I think a lot of people should be pulling for Seeker. That's like the last missing piece of the puzzle for your clan boss teams. And so keep that in mind. If you're new, I would probably be pulling for Skull Crusher. He can unlock so many things. So many things. Okay, so either way, I am pulling for Feral. Hopefully, we don't need all of these shards, but I don't have that many. And also, Plarium does not seem to want to provide options for purchasing some more. Uh, later today, I will be farming some Spider. That drops today, which is very convenient because I think that that lines up with my missions. Yes, Mythicals on Spider's Den. I'm still trying to catch up to where all of you are on these Marius missions. I am not there yet, and that is okay, but I will I will pass you. You better keep you better keep your uh, speed up on these missions, otherwise I'm coming for you. All right. So, other than that, I think what we're going to do is play some music and open some shards. I'm going to run the uh run the playlist from the new music channel while we're doing this and uh I'm super excited about that. I'm going to finish this video and then go work on mix number 2 over there. So, without further ado, let's jump in here. I'm always nervous about it. And don't forget your events that are going on, right? If you're working on them, make sure you do them. One Lego, let's get Feral one time, please. One time, one Feral. Pick your feet up. Actually, you're probably uh, watching this on your way to work or on your break at work. That's my guess anyway. Actually, tell me in the comments. Okay, first of all, are you pulling? Okay, let me know. But where and when do you watch my videos? That's an interesting question I have this morning. And also, we'll be pulling shards on stream tonight. I stream both at the same time. Here we go! Oh, Molly. Okay, I do love Molly. She's one of my favorite champions in the game. I have used her in tons of different teams, tons of different ways. Obviously, my favorite way to use her right now is in Hydra Clan Boss. I have had so many copies of her. She is one of, she might be my most pulled legendary on my entire account. I think that that is correct. It's close. Either her or Elkav, maybe. That was pretty funny. But that was just from one event or two events. Molly, I've pulled so many times throughout the course of play. Uh, but yeah, I stream uh, on Twitch and YouTube simultaneously, so you can watch on your platform that best suits your needs. But either way, come back on out. We're going to be having a blast pulling shards. I think I'm going to hold off on the two singles. We got eight sacreds. So far, I mean, I'm pleased with one legendary out of 40. 
That is a reasonable rate. I think Vogoth uh, has kind of got swept under the rug, but he's still amazing. Same thing with Maroka. She's an awesome uh, Revive on Death champion. You can use her in Sand Devil on your teams there. She's great. Who else? One Feral, please. Uh, also, typically on these progressive chance events, you should probably be saving your shards. Um, you know, I like to pull shards for fun and entertainment, but there are a lot of reasons to save your shards. <laughs> okay, Rockbreaker, still good. Still good after all these years, Rockbreaker. They're oh, baking me out. Basilisk. What we got? We're gonna... Rard. Still no Tyrell, huh? Last one. Lego, please. Lego, please. <sighs> okay, well, we still have hope we can get maybe another Sacred Shard from Clan Boss. I do have one Prism Shard, which freaking Polarium needs to add to the Summon Rush points list. I shouldn't be getting zero points for pulling these shards. That's stupid. Either end end the, the uh, event early, like Thursday. End it yesterday. Or it needs to count. Pick one. You can't have both. But, you know, maybe we'll get lucky and get a Falmond here. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Oh my goodness. That's insane. <laughs> I did not purchase any shards, uh, any prism shards here. I earned that one in Sand Devil. Dang. Wowzers. <laughs> oh, I don't know how to feel. Part of him is amazing. Part of him is not amazing. I don't really know what to do. I have been thinking about a sweet arena team with him. But then you have to... It's so hard. You have to include a bunch of Sacred Order people if you want him to work. I love this allies are immune to cooldown increasing effects. That's amazing. I mean, he does have decent multipliers on this single target. Ability his multipliers on the AoE is for crap. I would not count on that, but he can kill some dudes. Wow. <laughs> what a shocker. Okay, I am going to see about part two here because I really do want to try to get feral. Falmond is cool, but I don't know. Of all of the faction champions so far, I I guess he's he's good. But let me just tell you right now, nothing in the world is going to stop me from getting a faction champion for Skinwalkers. Nothing in the world. I'm just preparing you. I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to stockpile my budget behind the scenes and failing. Um, all right, well, that'll do it for me here today. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you. Hit that like button, and we'll see if we end up with a part two. I doubt it, but, you know, maybe Clan Boss gives us some shards. Maybe there's some uh, purchases made in the future. Who knows what happens? We'll see. We'll see. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.